Hello, my name is Tony Massantuano. I'm the product manager for Broadcast Picks, and today we're going to be talking about the iPixPad application for the Apple iPhone and iPod Touch. So the iPixPad is designed to replicate the PixPad on a Broadcast Picks control panel. And just to refresh everyone's memory, a PixPad on a Broadcast Picks basically simulates the clips and graphic content that's accessible through our workstation. So if I click a button on our control panel, it queues up here on my multi-view and it also takes it to air if it's on program. So again, if I go to my CG, you can go to your CG graphics and the name of the files appear on the buttons. And that's exactly what's going to be happening on the iPixPad application. So to start the iPixPad application on your home screen, just click on the iPixPad logo and it's all connected through a Wi-Fi connection. So if I go to the settings tab here on the bottom, you enter a dedicated IP address all through Wi-Fi. So as long as the workstation is on a Wi-Fi signal, you can enter your dedicated IP address along with the port number of 9999. Once you uh, enter those, that information, you'll get a little confirmation that you've successfully connected. And now you're ready to use the iPixPad app. So for example, I can go to my Memories button and our memories are just a snapshot of the panel. So I can easily go to my first home memory here and you notice that switched the broadcast pick slate switcher and brought my clip on air. I can also, for example, bring up a double box with another memory. And you notice in a single button, I put on my keyers, my clips, and my graphics all in one button. I can do some basic animations as well with my picks pad. Going back to the home screen here, I can also go to my clips and you'll notice the name of the clips are appearing on the buttons just like they do on the control panel and again as they appear here on the multi view. So instead of going to my wide wall, let me go to my Montreal Jazz Festival and there they are. Or I can easily go to Las Vegas and there's Las Vegas easily and you'll notice the uh, connection time is very very quick. Again I can go to my stills and all my stills appear in my picks pad. Go to my color bars, black, whatever you have loaded. If you wanted to, you have more next buttons with the forward and back buttons here on the iPixPad. So that's a, a quick overview of the iPixPad. If you have any questions, you can always contact me at Tony at broadcastpix.com.